Frances McDormand's gripping portrayal of the avenging mother will make her hard to beat for the upcoming Academy Awards. It is my pleasure to present the AFCO Award for Best Actress to the incomparable and my great friend, Frances Franny Wanny McDormand. <laughs> I don't know we're looking so pretty. You ain't trying to make me believe in reincarnation or something, are you? Because you're pretty, but you ain't her. She got killed. And now she's dead forever. Hello. Now, this is a room I was looking forward to being in. Thank you for this honor from the bottom of my cold, cold heart. I am tickled pink to be a part of this conversation. And yes, it is a conversation. And I'm deeply gratified that it was Mildred Hayes that brought me here. I mean, what are the odds of that? <laughs> so the other day I was complaining to my husband, as one does, about all this, what in our house we call the convention. I was whining about how we're not even halfway through and I am really tired of patting myself on the back and us all loving on ourselves. And he said, you know, that's too bad that it's boring because it should be a jubilee. That's why I love that guy, a jubilee. So let's allow ourselves for a minute to elevate the stories that we're honoring tonight, take them out of advertising and marketing, and put them a little bit higher, just for a second, just a little bit higher, and talk about dramatic literature. Okay, just be patient, because I wanna talk about the Furies and the humors. I got a taste of real fury playing Martin McDonough's Mildred Hayes. Not anger, which can be managed. Not rage, which is for bulls. But fury. White, hot, white, hot fury that leaves ashes in its wake. But what we know that maybe Mildred didn't is that often out of ashes grow bright, new, shiny things that are stronger than before. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And what Mr. McDonough and Mr. Peel know about humor is that it is a tonic for what ails us all. They tickle their audiences under the chin and then punch them in the gut. Watching their movies in a packed house is like being at a live theatrical event. Mm. Our collective gasps and moans and chortles make us a congregation. Mm. They unite us in the dark and they send us out on a better way. Mm. Quote one of my favorite Shaker hymns. The gospel is advancing and freedom is commencing. With leaping and with dancing, we'll hail the Jubilee. Thank you very much.